But the European Commission has concerns, serious concerns, that the new uh, uh, Turkish law on the internet is not compatible with the Charter of Fundamental Rights of the European Union, and in particular, uh, its Article 11 on freedom of expression on information, which, by the way, states that everyone has the right uh, to freedom of expression, and that this right uh, includes the freedom to hold opinions and to receive information without interference by public authority, which we believe is not the case. Yüksel Efsen, uh, you're a TV journalist from Adana in yes. Turkey. Yes. And you were saying there is a perception in Turkey that the European Union is a Christian club. Yes. Um, uh, why? Well, because uh, we found it's not fair after when the Cyprus accepted the European Union member. The Turkish population, Turkish citizens think that the European Union is a Christian club. Uh, we accept very early to the European Union, but all the long time we don't accept it. In my idea, we are not ready at this moment. Uh, mm -hmm. Our democratic system, our national law, and uh, other cities, uh, facilities, and it's not ready. Turkey is not ready, but all of the uh, Muslim countries in the Europe, it's out of the European Union. For mm -hmm. example, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Kosovo, Albania, and uh, Dora. Dora the, in those countries live a lot of uh, Muslim uh, population mm -hmm. and uh, at this moment when the Cyprus accept the European Union, Turkish population and Turkish citizens think the European Union is a custom club. Mm -hmm. In my idea, mm -hmm. I will say again, we are not ready mm -hmm. to accepting to the uh, European Union. Mm -hmm. Dana, just a, a reflection from you. How do you see the future uh, of Turkey? Is it in the European Union or is it still a very long way off? Actually, I think there is a long way for mm -hmm. us to join EU because uh, not because of the main uh, problems about religion or political. Mm -hmm. I think it's more about human rights. Mm -hmm. uh, in Turkey, there are many uh, violations about human rights because mm -hmm. of people's ethnic background, mm -hmm. sexual orientation, uh, because of their political views. Mm -hmm. uh, so many people uh, have many troubles about uh, government or let's say state. Mm -hmm. Then uh, the uh, new arrangements about the lo uh, laws they are really terrible for the people, for mm -hmm. the press especially, of mm -hmm. course, I, yeah, should, yeah. I should mention that. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, I think the government uh, does not so much care about the uh, regulations about EU, because mm -hmm. now they are trying to uh, have a safe position for their future, they, mm -hmm. uh, their uh, op opinions, uh, on EU are not mm -hmm. so clear, I think, because now they are trying to solve their problems mm -hmm, mm -hmm, within mm -hmm. their uh, political power, I think. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Thank you very much. You're Thanks welcome. a lot. <laughs> Maria Laura Franciosi, uh, vous êtes uh, journaliste uh, très expérimenté depuis des décennies. Uh, si on parle des relations entre la Turquie et l'Union Européenne, Quel est, selon vous, euh, le but stratégique Est-ce que la Turquie appartient à l'Europe Bien sûr, oui. Euh, il faut la, la Turquie fait partie de l'Europe, même s'il y a beaucoup de débats sur ça, mais la, la Turquie est un grand pays, un, un pays en développement, et un pays qui a euh, beaucoup de richesses, surtout richesses de... Euh, Les gens sont la, la grande richesse de, de, de la Turquie. Il y a des gens, il y a un âge moyen de 29 ans et ils sont tous jeunes et ça va être vraiment très important. Il y a beaucoup de problèmes politiques, mais ceci ne doit pas empêcher que le, le procès de, 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 de la Turquie en Europe Donc ça peut être une chance pour l'Europe si la Turquie en deviendrait partie. C'est une chance. C est, c est, je vois le futur de l'Europe avec, avec la Turquie. Merci beaucoup.